Pet of the Week, brought to you by Heritage Animal Hospital. All right, look at that tail. Yep, that means it's Pet of the Week. I'm joined by Myra. Oh, my gosh. First of all, let's introduce who this awesome person is. Well, awesome, not person, but these two furry friends that you have. Who are they? What are their names? Um, the little boy that you're holding is Mason, Aww. and then this little girl is Mona, and they have four other siblings back at the shelter. Um, there are two little brown ones like Mona, and then the rest of them are black. Oh, my gosh. And there's three boys and three girls. When you bring, it, like, all your furry friends, friends to, uh, to the station everybody is happy but right now everyone is excited because they're <laughs> puppies before we begin I have to say happy belated birthday thank you you know so what better way to then celebrate your birthday with two puppies so what right. are their temperament like I mean granted they're puppies they are 100% puppy they are super sweet they are very playful they love to play with everybody and everything and then they love to snuggle too. They do love to snuggle. And then there's a lot of things that are going on at the at the Humane Society. Let's talk about the angel tree. I mean, I know nothing like giving this time of season, but this time you can not only donate uh, your time, but there are certain items dedicated for each animal. What's going on? We do have a few trees set up. Our biggest one is at the shelter, of course. Mm -hmm. Um, but there's a tag for every animal in our building um, for different medical sponsorships. So there's the $30 option, which covers like shots and microchipping mm -hmm. and deworming. And then we've also got the $60 spay and neuter sponsorship for each animal. So it's a different way to help these animals out and hopefully help them find homes. Yeah, oh my gosh, such a great idea. And like I said, you can also donate time as well. How do people donate their time? Because I know you guys are always so focused on trying to get animals acclimated. Oh my gosh, I'm getting kisses. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can stop by the shelter anytime if you're interested in volunteering. Um, there's always lots of stuff to do, whether it's cleaning or just hanging out. And puppies a lot of times need baths, so when we have puppies, there's usually a lot of baths that go on. Yes, lots of baths indeed. I mean, these, oh my gosh, they're so adorable. Oh my gosh, look at the kisses I'm getting. I'm so, how can I ha contain and do an <laughs> interview when I'm getting all of this love? Oh my goodness. Okay, so we talked about the, oh, 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 somebody found my mic. So <laughs> not only is the angel tree and then donating your time, but there's also other needs that you guys need to cleaning supplies yes we go through cleaning supplies like crazy um, and a lot of people don't realize that we use a lot of newspapers um, <laughs> all the kennels are lined with newspapers for the cats and then the puppies so mm -hmm. they get rather messy so we go through quite a bit of newspapers when we have puppies so after you read your paper save it and drop it off sometime oh that's a good idea I didn't even think about that newspapers as well I mean not only are the cleaning supplies but newspapers would have thunk. Okay, okay. <laughs> Somebody is just really, really excited. Okay, Myra, so where can people go and, and, and find these adorable <laughs> puppies? We are at 2425 North Section Street. We're right off of 40 Lawn, so we're easy to find. All right, hours of operation are there on the screen as well as phone number. Make sure you check out their Facebook and their amazing website because you guys have made it like it's like a, a fur baby dating website. That's what <laughs> it I is. Would say. There's lots of information on there. <laughs> and then talk real quick. Talk about the um, the fact that if you're looking for a specific type of animal, you guys can put locators on that too. Yes. If you create an account with our website and you put in what kind of dog you're looking for, breed wise, or you can mm -hmm. even pick two or three. The second we get one of those and it's in our system, you'll be the first to know because you'll get an email. Oh, my gosh. All right, guys. It's your time to shine. It's your time to shine. All right. These cute little puppies need a home. Myra, thank you so much for bringing them and making my day. <laughs> Thanks for having us. Guys, stick with us. We have plenty more to come on Good Day Live.